Don't miss a beat, join the notification squad by clicking that bell, you'll get notified every time I upload a video, and be sure to join our Discord to talk and get help with your code. Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to our 7th episode of our Discord.js tutorials. My name's Stan, and today we'll be making a help command using a... Well, well, using a... It's gonna be dynamic instead of hard-coded, so you don't have to change the file every command you add. So let's get started. We're going to add our basic command setup again, which will be uh, this here. Um, this command is going to be based on functions. Uh, well, specifically based on functions to make our stuff easier. Um, there is going to be two options for this command: uh, get all and get command. Get all returns all the commands we got, and get command res returns the specific information of the command. Um, so let's get started with writing our get all function get all client and message. Uh, another thing I forgot to add is in the index.js file client categories is equal to fs. I require that too. Const fs require fs read dear sync and commands so that'll read all the command f uh, the, the command folders we have save that and exit uh, get all okay we're going to have an embed new rich embed uh, set color to let's use random uh, we're going to write a function an arrow function command a category this function will return all our commands in the specific category provided so return client commands filter where the command category is equal to the category we provided uh, map it by command some people might mess this up what I'm doing now so CMD name just l try to take a good look at these brackets I'll zoom in for you too this is better I think and um, now join it by a new string so that's that function uh, we got to have an info variable too which will return all the categories with the commands in it so client categories map category strip the indents uh, make it bold cat zero to upper case so what this does is um, return the category name but with a capital in the beginning so it looks a bit better slice one um yep new line and commands cat now we gotta reduce that string category string plus new line category there you go and return our embed of course message channel send the new embed set description info and let's try it out we gotta add it here too with um, get all client message save it and run it As you see it loaded let's try it out help there we go that's clean um, for some reason I'm missing the is command but I'll add that later don't worry about that um, now we also want to add the specific command information so function get command client message input uh, const embed is new rich embed um, const command 
is going to be either get input to lower to lowercase. It's going to be either the command name or the command ali alias client commands get client aliases. Um, input to lowercase and const no let let info is gonna be no information found for the command input to lowercase I don't know what's wrong here I actually do there you go uh, if no command, return message channel, send the embed, set color to red, which is either FF00 or just go for red, and set description info. Else, we're going to be adding the command name, alias, description, and the usage. So here we go, if command name exists, um, info is equal to the command name command name command name again um, if there is an alias cmd aliases info aliases let's add a new line here too um, mm -hmm, client oh no Command aliases map alias. Um, here we go with some other formatting again. Um, A. Okay. And join that by that. If there's a command description info plus is new line description now oh, let's also add these thingies everywhere um, cmd description and if there's a command usage scroll down a little info New line, use search, cmd usage, and embed set footer syntax is required, and this is op optional. So now we're going to be sending the embed to the channel set color uh, let's do green green set description info save it run the code again and there's Piyush, uh help better oh and I forgot to add the code in the run function of course if arc0 exists uh, return get command client message arcs one uh, zero else return get all client message There we go, so that one works, and let's also try out report, uh, help, report, help, help, as you see, report, everything is in there, so that's amazing. Um, thank you for watching this video once again, I hope you guys liked it, uh, like this, and I think it, it'll save a lot of your time, not hard coding every command in. So make sure to leave a like below and subscribe to our channel. And I'll hope to see you guys later. Bye bye.